you see behind me is Ten Mile River, which runs into the Delaware River about four miles south of Narrowsburg. I had come down here about uh, two days ago, and the river was much higher then, and we've had two beautiful days in the western um, Catskills, and I just wanted to give you just a brief uh, explanation about Ten Mile River. Um, there's about six, 7,000 acres that belongs to the New York City Council of Boy Scouts, and they've had this land since the 1920s. And what you see behind me is Ten Mile River running into the main stem of the Delaware River. And uh, this river runs very nicely in uh, April and early May if we get some rain. The New York State DEC stocks it with brown trout. And at the confluence of Ten Mile River and uh, the main stem is a very good shad spot as well. I'll pan around and I'll show you the uh, Stone Arch Bridge that was built uh, around the turn of the century, I believe. There was also a grist mill here at one time. So until we see each other again, this is Tony Ritter of the Hawaii Fish and Guide Service in Narrowsburg, New York. Hi everybody, this is Tony Ritter of Dawn Fishing Guide Service on the Upper Delaware River out of Narrowsburg, New York, and today I'm at the uh, confluence of Ten Mile River and the main stem of the Upper Delaware River, which is right behind me, and uh, I had just taken a couple of videos of Ten Mile River and the Stone Arch Bridge. I wanted to walk down and show the folks what the main stem of the Delaware River looks like on a beautiful day. Uh, past couple of days in the western Catskills where we are, about two hours northwest of New York City, has been gorgeous. Afternoon air temperature in mid-March, it's been about almost 60 degrees, light breeze, just a beautiful day. All of the snowpack is gone, and uh, this is a great sh shad spot right behind me. You can probably hear or see the little ripples where the river pitches up, and uh, we fish for shad in early May to mid-June, and the water temperature is about 48 to about 68 degrees. 52 to about 60 degrees is prime, and the shad run in schools, come up from the ocean once a year to spawn, and anytime you find an area of the river which bottles up, pinches up, like that area where Ten Mile River dumps into the main stem right be uh, behind me, that's a great spot to be uh, fishing. So I wanted to show the folks uh, on the internet what uh, this river looks like on a beautiful day in Ten Mile River. Again, about five miles south of Narrowsburg. And this is Tony Ritter. This is my 16th year operating a drift boat guide service for wild trout, shad, smallmouth bass, and walleye. And we're only two hours northwest of New York City. Feel free to email me or give me a call if you have any questions whatsoever. This is a beautiful area, and I hope to see you on the river. Take care.